Cool. So, are you ready to get going, man? Yeah. Yeah? Mm hmm. You ready to roll? Yes, sir. Sound check, check, check. One, two. Chickity, check, 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 check. Check yourself before I wiggity wreck yourself. <laughs> and you're pretty good, man. The Chicago uh, <laughs> street life back in the day growing up. Yeah, I was, I was kind of a nerd. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, shoot. Hey, guys. Uh, welcome back. Thank you for uh, watching these videos. Uh, you know, we're just kind of having fun uh, with these, and I hope you guys enjoy it as well. Uh, we're still missing Ryan, so kind of a bummer, you know. The trio hasn't been together since, oh my gosh, Christmas. Yes, we're three and amigos. We just turned turned over into March, so the, that guy's been down this whole time with his back, and it's a first for him to be out this long, I think, ever in his life. Yeah. Probably since he popped out of the womb. You know, yeah. that guy was working and welding and grinding and doing things, and now he can. So it's a really bad, it's a bad deal. It's a bad deal. Yeah. So we've been praying for him, and... Uh, we really want him to, to get back here and, and hang out and do things. You know, we're out in the shop working without him, and it's been kind of kind of different. So. Yeah, it's hard to get. It's hard to keep you on task. Yeah, it, it definitely is hard to keep yeah, me on task. I, so I, I need my. Task we're really back. missing the the guy that actually gets things done. I need the task. <laughs> so, yeah. speaking of the shop, we've been working on the sixty two Mercury. We got it running last week, so that was a that was fun, man. That was cool. It's been way way too long coming, but yeah, but. Got it out on the road and drove it around with open headers, so really yeah, loud. Yeah, it, it was it was pretty exciting. You you were really excited and I, and uh, <laughs> I was extremely nervous. Yeah, just because I was like watching all the gauges and like yeah. you know like I'm feeling the brake. Does it actually work? Because like this yeah. is the first time we're rolling and shoot. Yeah, there was a lot that could have gone wrong. Yeah, it really could have. So that's our '62 Mercury yeah. Monterey project, and we did a full rebuild on a 390 FE V8 motor. Uh, never really done that before, so that was a first for us. Took forever, but it's together. It's running. It's holding together, and it's the motor's not leaking, so that's good. We got a few other leaks that we got to still yeah. take care of, but but it's pretty good. So so that was fun. Yeah. So guys, this is Maniacs React. This is the show that's a 30-minute episode. Typically, every week we try to re release one, and we pick three vehicles, uh, two that are. Kind of our our main kind of kind of kind of things that are more up our alley, and then we kind of throw in a bonus kind of wild card yeah. at the end just for fun. So hope you guys stay to the end and you see you know see what we have for today. And uh, we got a good lineup. Yeah, we Hopefully. got a good lineup. Yeah. So I think it's going to be fun. So are you ready to get started, man? It's, it's always fun. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and by the way, I almost forget every time that we have a three tier grading system that we do on these cars. Grading so. or rating. Grading or rating. Whatever. Uh, yep. So we have a cranker, which is a something like yeah. that. We have a cruiser, which is more of a no, 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 no revelations. Wrong arm, bro. Wrong arm, bro. Wrong arm. Wrong. That's a cruiser. And then we have on a limiter. On the limiter. And that's the limiter right there, guys. So rate these things with us. Make sure you guys leave us a comment, thumbs up, all that good stuff, and make sure you're subscribed because that's one of the biggest things with all these guys on YouTube. Is that most of the people are not subscribed, and it really hurts the the algorithm, the, the, flow. Uh, the flow, the push of these videos out to other people who may be interested in it. So do subscribe, and uh, I think you'll like the content that we put out. So you know, we do this, we do the work out in the shop, and then we do some show coverage um, here and there, and we also do some really cool interviews with builders with some cool custom stuff. And we love, you know, ratty kind of patina. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, we have a body swap uh, that we have out in the shop, you know, the 49 with the BMW, and we really like that kind of stuff. So kind of crazy stuff, not your typical custom car stuff. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Love right. the patina. Love the patina. So let's get rolling with the first vehicle. Vehicle. The vehicle. Hear it? Yeah. Here it is. There it is. Drop it. Boom. There it is. Ooh, right. kind of hard to tell. I like it. Super techy looking, man, with those bolts, you know, on the windshield frame. Yeah. Not that one. The one that, the, the one that, the one that uh, is being driven right here. Yeah. So this thing, man. So this is actually a. I think it's a Jeep Willy. Started out. Yeah, I mean, it, life. Was, it was. So, um, but it's super slammed, hacked, you know, sectioned. Custom frame, obviously, just sitting on the ground. Yes. 
Yes. yes. And so it, it, I always love this. So there's a, there's a few of these running around, you know, yeah. like on Instagram, some Jeeps and stuff. This one's special. You know, this was built by a guy named, uh, I think it's Joshua uh, or Josh maybe, um, at Village Customs. Mm -hmm. And uh, this guy's pretty brilliant. He's built a lot of different vehicles. So this one's pretty wild, but there there are a few out there, you know, they're kind of Jeep rods or yeah, Jeep, I don't know. Jeep rod, I like that. Jeep rod, yeah. uh, something like that. Yeah. And obviously this one's got a Cummins turbo diesel in it with, you know, nice, it just looks massive looking yeah. at them with yeah. how low the car is. And I don't sure. know, the diesel, you know. In the for, yeah, in the forward uh, front wheels, the wheels are. The yeah, wheels yeah, are forward, on. yeah, push forward, more yeah, kind yeah. of a, yeah, kind of an old hot rod kind of a thing and in their off-road tires which well is, <laughs> i mean and i was gonna say that's, yeah, that's probably one of my favorite things is when it's not supposed to fit right for that vehicle yeah and it's and just used you like. i like, like that yeah. i like it when it's different you know, like that, tires, you know? they're, they're out like this they're like ready to grab something and you yeah like you're driving it, and you can just like kind of yeah. yeah just conquer it grab it mm -hmm. um i'm sure it's bagged because it's sitting yeah. on the ground right now mm -hmm. but love the off-road tire look on a slam jeep you know and people go man what a waste you know just ruined it right mm -hmm. i come on there's a million jeeps out there it's not really ruining them right yeah. by, doing, <laughs> by, by doing a cool pull one out and make it really wild and different yeah. you know so uh there is a lot out there especially we're here in southern arizona they're everywhere yeah and they all look the same so <laughs> more or less right uh, but not uh, this one. Not this yeah, one. Yeah, not this, this one. I, I like the military kind of has a little military vibe, you sure. know, because the color oh, and then the star. star. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dude, though, I don't know what's up with the twin exhaust system on it. You know, do you think he's running some sort of? I mean, uh, twin turbo. I'm sure maybe compound turbo, but then that wouldn't call for a dual exhaust coming out like that. So, I wonder what the I story know, is man, with that. Comment if you know because. Yeah. Yeah, I, I just I just don't maybe, know. Maybe he split it. Yeah, and you can't see it right yeah, there. So it's but, too tough to call. But I mean, what what would call for that? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not really that sure. But uh, we got. Like, I mean, twin turbos would call for that, you know. But not in the configuration of the compounding turbo system, right? Because that's all in line, so that would be the same exhaust. So I don't know. Um, it's hard to yeah. see it. Maybe yeah. it is. Too. Maybe it is just split out into two, coming out of a collector of some sorts there, which would be cool too. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I like it. Yeah, I dig it. Man, uh, um, yeah, I want one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I've had some inspirations, aspirations. I don't know what the word is for it. You know, mm -hmm. to do something like that. You know, we have that Volvo out there, and I've been throwing around different ideas. And originally, when I got it, I thought we would put it on a four-wheel drive you know, frame mm -hmm. and looking around Jeeps were kind of the most affordable in a way to find Platform, sure. Yeah. You know, what's the rectangle headlight ones, you know, uh, uh, JK, YJ, y, 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 YJ. the yeah. YJs, yeah. they seem like they're not, you know, the value's not there for those. They have different mm -hmm. suspension. People don't like them, whatever. Um, so they were, you know, there were some affordable ways to do that. And I thought maybe pick one of those up, save the body, use the frame, put the Volvo on it and then have this really cool, you know, uh, Gambler 500 kind of a ride, uh -huh. you know, four-wheel drive, and then have a Jeep body sitting around for something like this, maybe. Yeah, we, yeah, we can build a build our own chassis. That'd yeah, just build cool. a, build a basic chassis, and that, and yeah. then you know, I do like the off-road tires a lot, and I do want to do something like that one day where it's like a like a rat rod with you know off-road tires, but but I thought that the Jeep would have been cool because we have an extra set of hostel wheels out there right now, and we could have done a staggered set of hostel on it. You know what I mean? All in good time. All in good time. time. Yeah. So, so oh, hey, let's get back to the show. Yeah. Where are we? we just kind of completely went off, uh, so off on a little tangent. So we gotta we gotta rate this thing. Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 So oh, you know what? I, I kind of like the um, what we didn't really touch on is the steering wheel. Yeah. I kind of like the muzzle on a uh, mm. rifle. I think that's. I gotcha. What, I think that's what they're trying to hit there. I'm okay. Not exactly sure, but it's kind of like the. I'm I'm pretty sure those are available. I don't know if he custom made that necessarily. He could have, yeah. but I think they're available. I'm not sure what the application is, but I'm thinking it's like an aluminum steering wheel that's cross drilled like that. Okay. I'm not sure what you know. Maybe it's some sort of racing application. Maybe stock car or something. I don't know. Okay. 
but it is, uh, I think you're right, though. I think that is probably a, the motif that they're going yeah. after with the whole military, you know, thing. Yeah, he, he looked like he's sitting in the Midwest, too. Looks like he might have, a, a, like, a shotgun or something. The dude sitting in, <laughs> sitting yeah, down, yeah, you see that, while he's doing a smoky burnout. He's, he's like a turret, <laughs> turret with a guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah. Could, that could definitely work. 50 cal, bro. Yeah, that could definitely work. All right. Well, All what, right, was, your, so what was your favorite part about it? Uh... How low it is, how it kind of mm. sits within the tires, tucked in the frame, just that that vibe of it. That, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I like that it, it took a Jeep and just totally made it <laughs> liquid cool. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's rad, dude. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, go first. Oh, man. What are you doing to me like that, man? I mean, you got to do some work. Yeah, yeah I got to do something. You've been sitting here. I, do, I have. Look at that Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. All right. So, man. Ah, it's taking a long time. You're really putting a lot of thought into this it, thing. You normally, it's, you know, it's, yeah. it's, it's kind of a cruiser. Really? Okay. You okay. know, I mean, it, it, you know, it, I'm going to go cruiser. All right. I'm going cruiser. All right, cruiser. Well, no, there there is no rev limit. Yeah. There's no there's no pop 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 in a cruiser. It's yeah. just a wah, 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 yeah. Wah, yeah. Wah. yeah. I'm cruising. Come on. Man, come on. Come on. I'm off my <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go on the limiter on this okay. just because I like the concept. I like kind of everything really about it. I like the concept. I like the execution. No, it's not a show car. It's not meant to be. You know, no, it's, it's no. a rat rod. It's it's ratty. It's you know, it's finished. I mean, I don't even think it's unfinished necessarily. No. You know, but uh, I, I I just like it. So I'm gonna go wop up 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 limiter on this one, and uh, we can we can move on to our sponsor of the day in between the two vehicles. Oh man! Oh, okay, oh, all right. You do get excited. All right, so all right. so today's yeah. sponsor, you guys, it is Optima Batteries. And Optima Batteries, I've been kind of been connected with those guys for a better part of probably two decades. I would say pretty easily. I ran Optima in quite a few of my show cars, my SEMA builds years past. Mm -hmm. uh, cool, my orange Berge had an orange top, you know, at the time it was kind Ooh. of an experimental, you know, now they do have the orange tops, but they're for a different application. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, I ran the Op Optimas uh, in most, pretty much everything I've had. And so currently uh, they are partners with us um, in our, on our channel. So Optima batteries, that's one of their chargers, a really cool, uh, kind of a smart charger if you will um, and so that's awesome but they have batteries for pretty much anything you want yeah, so you can check them out at uh, Optima too. Batteries and Classic their vehicles. Instagram and yeah 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 you yeah and the UTV stuff you know UTV, they're working on some super ski, super light stuff now so awesome awesome stuff so Optima Batteries all right you ready for the next car yeah are you mm -hmm. all right now Let's 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 show this. Let's let's go to the next vehicle. Let's show them. Let's show them. Uh, if I can just find where my mouse is on this thing, mm -hmm. that'd be super awesome. All right, here it is. And Woo, baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, the Volkswagen Bug. Just a bug. Just a bug, just a bug just man. A bug. Just a bug. I, I kind of got the bug. Hemi V8. It's just a bug with the Hemi V8. Nice. <laughs> So I don't know the, the whole story on this thing. I've been following this thing for a while too. So it's called the Hemi Bug. Again, if you guys know more about it, please, you know, leave a comment on this video. Let us know. I think this is the last guy that kind of the hands that it went through. Uh, this is a realtor up in Phoenix. Um, and and I, you know, he didn't build it. Like I said, he, he might be like the third owner. I'm not exactly sure. It seems to me that he might be the third owner on this. Um, don't know who the actual original builder was. Maybe it was uh, Mickey Thompson. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's not. It's not an old. It's not an old build. This is actually a pretty new build. Like I'm thinking, it's maybe like a year or two old. Uh, this build, like when it came out, and uh, I, I don't know the original builder, but in any case, it, it exchanged hands a couple times. It's super wild, man. So I mean, it's got a like a tube chassis, you know, custom custom mm -hmm. frame on it. Uh, looks like it does some business too when you get on it. 
but you should, mm, right? Because yeah. it's a Hemi in a bug. <laughs> so, yeah. right? I like the proportions. I think they're really cool. I like the open wheel. I, I like the, the double wishbone kind of control arms on the looks, front. looks longer than well, I mean, the body. Well, I mean, the front got the same idea like the last one had. Mm -hmm. uh, and and I, I, I think I mentioned on the last one is Village Customs is where you can find that Jeep uh, Willie's uh, mm -hmm. Village Custom on Instagram. So, yep. Uh, this one, yeah, so kind of has the same vibe, you know, the front axle, you know, width or track is, is wheelbase, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Am I mm -hmm. trying to say it? Yeah, say um, it. Is, is, is stretched, you know, forward. Mm -hmm. Thing is chopped. It's channeled. You know, chop is when you chop the roof. Channeling is when you take out a piece from the belt line, which is like the bottom of the window down to the floor. So that's channeled when you take out horizontally there. So this thing is obviously channeled because it's, it's very low, you know, compared to Volkswagen Bug. And, but I like the wheel setup on it. It kind of reminds me of, it's kind of like an F1, like reminiscent, isn't it? Yeah. Just, you see an open wheel, yeah. like Formula One, yeah. kind of a look to it, uh, oh, yeah. the, way, the way the wheels are. And then look at the, look at the independent suspension setup. Oh, it's, it's, I, don't, I don't know what they, I don't know if it was fully custom built from scratch or if they used it off of something. But, um, dude, it's got a Hemi in it. You're you're a Ram guy. You yeah. guys can't see it because we've got a black on black logo here, but that's a Ram trucks that's right Ram there. So you Ram like Hemi. that Hemi? You got a Hemi in that thing? I do. Yeah. I do. All right. Yeah. So can you imagine the motor in your truck is actually in that bug? <laughs> you need to get one of those carbon fiber end cleaners for your I truck. Do. That'd be really yeah. nice. Wow. Oh. My, birth, my birthday's coming. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I, I, that's probably a little more than what I want to spend on your birthday. <laughs> but doesn't it look? It looks the body looks stretched the, because it's so because it's so chopped. I think it just you gives you that. I really that do. Panel. It gives you that it illusion. Like yeah, yeah. And then the seats like pushed way back inside of it. Yeah. Right. And I think that's yeah, because it's so chopped because you got no leg room at that point. But I think they did that on purpose. Okay. Um, Love the color. I think it's so cool. I love yeah. that kind of Nardo gray kind of Cement. thing that everyone's doing for the last five years now. Yeah. Uh, no, that's good. But it's, it's, it's cool. White interior that's very like race car esque. You know, if you got the all white interior and I like the painted. Seats. Yeah. yeah, the aluminum seats. Yeah. Pretty wild, yeah. huh? Yeah. I'm, I'm sure they're not super comfortable, but hey, you know. Well, they, look, they look like I fit, so that's pretty that's encouraging. And I don't know how many of you guys are like Volkswagen buffs, but and I'm not, but I do know my bug you know a little bit. Me. I know a little bit, and I can tell you just from that deck lid that this is kind of a newer one. Um, what do you mean newer? Like a like a Beetle or not? It's not a Super Beetle because it still has the flat winch windshield on it, but that rear deck lid has those vents in it, and it's kind of wide. Like it's not it's not like the sought after like I don't know pre '67 or whatever they are from okay. '60. I guess some of the bug um, they just had a, like a different looking deck lid on it. Okay, but so it wasn't like uh, and it's got like the big back window, obviously, you know. So it's it, at least it didn't cut up a, a precious, you know. Uh, you that's know, a what we do. Bug. Though, I mean, <laughs> I, that's 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 that what is we, what we, we do. encourage. That is what we do. We do encourage. I that. mean, that's right. Sometimes <laughs> I mean, you find it, you cut it up. I mean, it wasn't really doing much, anyways. <laughs> Yeah, we do encourage yeah, uh, you know weeds growing up through these things and oh, yeah, and there's a million of them. I mean, they built those things forever, dude. And was it forties? I think they started, right? Forties, and then uh, they they've been built. They were building them in Mexico even like up until recently. Did you know that? No. Yeah, like, yeah literally like, like nineteen, the, like eighties, nineties. I think they're still building bugs in Mexico. As recent? Yeah, as recent as that. That's pretty recent. Pretty anyway. recent, okay. Maybe it was more recently. I don't uh, know. Again, we need we need we need uh, you know viewer input. Yeah, you know, we just, you know, leave us help us out. We're just we're, we're just uh, we're just spit spitballing here, so <laughs> we really know nothing. <laughs> I mean, we know nothing. So let's talk uh, about the Hemi engine. You know? Oh yeah, talk about it. You know, talk about yeah, it, Mister so, Dodge over yeah. here. Yeah. So like the Hemi engine was actually outlawed because it was so powerful when it came out. Like the race. NASCAR mm. was like, no, it's really like, yes. Hmm. This is fact or fiction? It's fact. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So then, how did they bring it back in? Yeah. Yeah. They brought it back in. They tried putting it in all their uh, their uh, production vehicles out of the race cars, and then it kind of morphed into like, it, I guess, I guess the technology really worked. You know, you have a a domed piston head, 
with your, <clears throat> your valve coming in. But I don't know. I like the bad ribbon. Is it domed up or the no? The, is it concave or convex? The, the so you got more. The, well, or you, less. Uh, you have you have more cubic inches in it. Okay. You, you have more. It's domed up. <coughs> oh, it's domed up. So it's actually a higher compression. Maybe is what ends up happening with it. I mean, you can huh. you can do that lots of different ways. I don't know. I guess I got to stop talking. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I mean it's more, the more space, I mean, actually lower in compression because mm. you're t adding space. But, I mean, it just all depends on. Well, and there you guys go. A little, little, little factoid yeah. on, uh, on but Hemi's. Hemi so. stands for hemispherical. Yes. I, I, do, I did know that. Uh, yeah. but I just didn't know exactly yeah. how hemispherical. So. Yeah, the piston's not domed, flat piston. Okay, so the head of the cylinder head is domed. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. I, I was picturing the top of the piston. No, 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 no. All right, no. cool. Flat, I'm, flat I'm on the same page. I'm on the same head. page with you now. Okay. okay. All right. All right. Cool. You, ca you caught up. All, All right. right. I'm a little slow sometimes. I'm gonna go ahead and rate this thing now, though. And uh, you know, I mean, I, I'm gonna go rev limit, man. Should I'm we, gonna go rev limit, dude. Should we do it at the same time? Sure, but you gotta do it with the correct arm. Okay, re all right, ready? Okay, hey, all right. One, two, three. Two, three. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> all right, good job. All right, so yeah, we're 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 pretty crazy about this one. I think it's super cool. I wonder how much it sold for. I think it just sold actually right now to somebody. Yeah, somewhere. <laughs> the somebody guy from Phoenix somewhere. sold it to somebody. Oh, the, the guy somewhere. in Phoenix sold it again. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, he just sold it right like recently. I don't know how recently, but recently, wow. fairly recently. Got the number right there. Let's call. Him. <laughs> Let's call I know, right? Hey, man, we're doing the show, and we want to know what you sold that thing for. Hey, dude, are you ready for something fun? Something super fun? Mm -hmm. Okay. You? So, right. well, hold on. Okay. So the third car we do here on the show is it's something wild, something off kilter. Hmm. That's a good word, off kilter. That's you know, good, good. Good description. Well, yeah. What was the last one we did? You remember the boats? The boats, the we turbo, the turbo four boats cylinder boats in Taiwan or Thailand. Thailand. Yeah, Thailand. Thailand. Yeah. Thailand. So the, yeah, that was kind of crazy. So crazy. This was so, something so we've crazy. done stands. We've done Carolina squat. Uh, I don't know. I can't think of all the other uh, ones right now. So. Hydraulic. Yeah, we did some hydraulics, some ho hoppers and stuff. So some so just multi, some like triple, quadruple, quintuple, oh. turbo yeah. vehicles, yeah. multiple of those. Yeah. Just wild Five turbos. Yeah, wild Qu quintuple turbos. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. So I mean, I don't know if I liked it, but it was fun. Yeah. So 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 here we go. So, so we got something kind of crazy. I'd say it's a little crazy. Mm -hmm. I'm ready to show it to them. Yep. See if they think it's crazy. So show them the boy math. There it is. So I think, you know, what the guy was thinking is that if, you know, a couple of things on the car are good, then even more is better, right? Or more is like better. More is better. More better cheddar. So I'm, it's yeah. looking like it's maybe an F-150. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm with you now. <laughs> Looks like a yeah. extra cab, uh, you know, F-150. I don't think it even matters. And he literally, man, I was looking at this for a while before we put it, put this thing together. Yeah, before for we talked to you, we had to like examine and, this. Yeah, and I was trying to make out like what pieces he used, you know. So like, lots of pieces, oh, man. Like so, obviously we got some push bars on the front. Mm -hmm. I get it, you know. Mm -hmm. Those are some, you know, different push from bar, some different bolt, vehicles. Pull bars. Yeah, but he's using like in you know, a bunch of lights and all of that, and then like another grill shell up on top on the roof rack is like a, is like a grill insert. You see that? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't know, man. Only in America. I, I, I can only imagine what the wiring looks like to get all those legs wired up. If it's oh. if, it, if it's any indication as to what the rest of the mods are, <laughs> it'd be really really interesting to see how the connections are done. It's gotta be clean. It's clean. So, so, you know, I'm sure it gets looks wherever he goes. Uh, oh, yeah, that's, that's, a, that's, a, that's a talking point for sure. <laughs> Every time he goes to get fuel, he's probably got people standing around wanting to talk to him. Yeah, I, I, bet you he gets, I bet you he gets more attention with that than we do with the 49 Ford when we pull up in the gas station. Probably, yeah. unfor unfortunately. I mean, yeah. I bet you he got some attention from his significant other, too. <laughs> if he has one, <laughs> yeah, I mean, if he or she has one at this point, right? Because yeah. this could have been built by a woman. I don't know. Doesn't look like it though. That's definitely 
a man. That's that's a man came up with it. <laughs> the man cave, the man cave truck. He's just sitting in his man cave, going, ah, you know, I got this F one fifty, but yeah, it's just not that cool. Yeah, I just need to do do something. <laughs> I, just to, I just wonder how this went down. You know, like he just put like one set of bumpers on first, and he's like, oh, that's pretty cool. And then he was like, oh man, I finally saw the bumper at the you know garage sale, and then like puts it on. He's like, oh, that's 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 even cooler. I I kind of don't want to take the other one off. I kind of like how the two together look, and then. A third piece and a fourth piece and you know what I mean yeah like it's a culmination of years of you know kind of how you know we built the 49 all crazy right because of years of, of stuff in my head that I wanted to put together is that what happened to this guy something happened to this guy I mean it's all, <laughs> it's, it's all centered it's all it's all like like symmetrical Sim- is that what you're trying yeah, to say it's, it's, it is look at it. the center is yeah i mean it's got in. it's got the proper proportions left yeah, and right yeah, you know I with mean, with the things so um all right it's, it's all Fine. intentional yeah. it's intentional i can't keep looking at it anymore yeah, man yeah, I, I, so I'm, I'm, I'm ready to, i'm yeah. ready to give it a rating on yeah, this one so okay I, are you, you want are you are you brave enough to do a simultaneous one again on this one uh-huh yeah simultaneous yeah, it's, it's like hell one. it's like rock paper scissors <laughs> okay ready one Two, two, three. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> nice, dude. All right. Well, yeah. So that that just had to get that because yeah. there's no way. <laughs> yeah. So oh man. With that though, you know, you know, you've seen a, a lot of these uh these funny pick it on women girl math co- commercials, you know, where they like they they buy something and when they get to return it and then they're like, oh, the money they get back is free. Right. It's okay. Like, so, like, the antipathy. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> That's gonna be a big word. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna go ahead and use something else here. The opposite of that <laughs> is the boy math, right? Where yeah. you put, you know, twenty five thousand dollars into a car worth fifteen hundred. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, dude, and we're like, okay with it. Maybe you'll find yeah. this on Craigslist for nineteen thousand bucks. You know, but. But if, Heavily modified F-150. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, One of a kind. One of a kind. <laughs> oh, man. She, she's cherry. <laughs> Can you imagine? All I right. can't imagine. Here we go. All right, guys. If you made it this far, these are our sticker packs, our decal packs. Uh, you get six different decals on one sheet. We want to give one of these away to somebody who will leave the first comment. <coughs> On this video, can you cough somewhere else? I'm so loud. I know. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, but I'm not kidding about this. No. Leave a comment. First one who leaves a comment on this video is gonna get one of these. So we want to connect with you, get your address, and mail this off to you. So leave a comment on here, and yeah, please, you know, leave, you know, or just comment on on the stuff that we looked at today. Uh, maybe want you know maybe send us some ideas of what you guys might want to see on this thing. Yeah, if you got some cars you want to see. <sighs> yeah, and hopefully the next time we see you guys, Ryan's gonna be with us, and uh, we'll be you know doing it all three of us. Maybe we will have to go to his living room, dude, and just do I it remote. I thought about it too before, yeah. so we might have to make a, a remote the, a remote it's be session. Hard with the nine kids we got running around that joint. Yeah, we could, yeah. but I don't know. We'll see. We can go out of his. He's got a nice shop out next to his house, though. So. Oh, yeah. We can maybe go in the shop and, and do it there. So, either way, yeah. God bless you guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in another one.